Katie here from Luck Via Katie, and I've got my July 2019 Boho Berry box, so it is unboxing time. I can already tell you I'm really pumped about this box. There's been some controversy over the contents of the box, the Boho Berry box being quality, and I'm here to tell you that they don't disappoint, especially with their July 2019 box. So I'm really excited about this month's theme, and let's dig in. So the theme officially is called Summer Refresh, and here's a little card that comes in the vellum envelope, and on the back it always explains um, the contents inside the box. So I'm going to leave this on hand, even though I already know what's in it. So first of all, we've got a really cute washi tape, which reveals that this month's theme is watermelons, which I was really hoping they would do a watermelon theme. I've been wanting to do one in my bullet journal for a while, so I'm really pumped. So um, here we've got, these are quote unquote theme stickers that are signature to this box. These are more um, with little trackers and just to do and stuff like that. And then we've got the July 2019 tracker, which I can use for habit tracking, uh, self-care tracking. I'm not really sure what I'll use it for specifically, but I always use these, as you'll see in my next video coming up. Plug for that later. Um, and here's the cutest little, I just love these, the cutest little paper clip of the uh, watermelon. I'll go ahead and take it out. So this cute little clip, cute. I love the bows, cute, so cute. And they have a website, thecraftymail.com, or you can follow them on Instagram at thecraftymail. Again, that's thecraftymail, M-A-I-L. So, cute. Okay, now we've got some really fun, fun, fun things in this box. This is the Leuchtturm 1917 A5 in Berry, I believe is the color. Yes, I was correct. It is in Berry, and it is an A5 dot grid. This is probably the most dominant and popular in, bo in Boho Berry in bullet journaling. Um, it's not the only kind. Uh, I've done a lot of research on this for a couple of years now. A lot of people use um, the Moleskin, Rhodia, uh, Scribbles That Matter. All of them are great components, and I believe Kara has reviewed most, if not all, of these on her channel. That's at Boho Berry. I highly recommend if you're new to buying a bullet journal. You don't just buy the first one. You do a little research. Lots of bullet journalists, such as myself, do reviews, and the Boho Berry is where I started and got all of my information about these. So, Blake's Germ 1970 A5 Dot Grid in Berry. This will be my next bullet journal, and I'm really excited about that is the Faber-Castell's um, color markers. Now these I am not familiar with at all. I'm super excited. Um, when I set up my new bullet journal, uh, when I set up my collections for the rest of the year for 2019 actually, I'm not sure if that will be in the bullet journal that I'll make again or if I will make a separate insert for collections that's separate from my actual bullet journal. Either way, I will be doing a review and test of each of these colors on the page. Um, there are 20 grip color markers from Faber-Castell. Um, these look really good. They're supposed to, you know, they're just your basic non-toxic washable water-based uh, color markers, but I'm excited to get some different flow. I use my Tombow dual brush pens all the time and I still will, but I think for this month's I might touch on these, so yeah, I'm excited. Um, that wraps up everything in the box, so I'll just do um, a little wrap up of what everything was. You saw these, the Faber-Castell um, markers, the colored markers. Again, there's 20. They're non-toxic and washable and water-based. And then we've got oh, the Leuchtturm 1917A5 in Berry, which will be my next bullet journal. Um, we've got the little paper clip from um, the Crafty Mail. So cute. And then we've got the Boho Berry signature stickers that are exclusive to the box and Boho Berry. And so these are the little Summer Refresh stickers that are gonna go with the tracker and the other signature stickers. Where we started, the watermelon washi tape. Um, I'm really excited to use all of these elements in my July spread, so I wanted to plug for that. I will be doing videos every month of my setup, um, even if I don't do them in a journal with me 
format, I will be presenting at least what I've made, hopefully before I've filled anything out in it or filled out information. Also, I will be doing a video of my 2019 January through June bullet journal video, and I actually have her packed away in my backpack at the moment, so I will be showing her off. Um, to kind of give you guys, my my subscribers or anybody out there who's interested in bullet journaling, a chance to see kind of how I set it up. And I'm a little crafty with it. I'm not the most artistic, but I'm definitely not the least artistic. So I'm somewhere in the middle of the road, and I'll be showing off my themes and spreads that I've created for 2017. I mean, 2019. What year are we in? Anyway. All of the items in my video today will be linked in the description box below. They do come in this month's uh, Boho Berry Box. That's July 2019 Boho Berry Box. I also have included a code for $5 off your, for your first box. And uh, if you don't mind, go there by way of my referral link. That would be great. Stay tuned for these videos coming up, and please uh, go check out Kara Benz uh, at Boho Berry, YouTube, Instagram, Facebook. They've got a Boho Berry Tribe Facebook group that I love to be a part of. We discuss all things bullet journal, all things organi organization. So, yeah, I hope you guys have a wonderful day and live your worth, yeah? Yeah.